Tales Town! Dance, 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 dance. Hello, welcome to the general area of Dance Den YouTube. I, I, I say that because I actually didn't think of a name for this area. I'm just I guess we could just call it Dance Den. This is like the place. This is the place where I do the videos uh, on the general stuff that you guys ask. So, for example, I've actually got a list. So I work with some learners on, of course, creating this. They inspired this. They actually pretty much designed this. So big thank you to you guys. And I, uh, <laughs> some of these, I just, honestly, but <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. Don't get me wrong. Um, but I want to make one thing clear, and I've really got to make this clear, is that while I am indeed a coach, life coach and performance coach, the sphere of my competencies sit within the area of, of course, helping you develop positive mental attitudes, helping you develop positive visions of your future and you feel a lot better in yourself. What my skills are not in the area of are things like counselling and therapy. I can certainly talk on the topic of certain mental health things, but that will be it. And I'm not an expert in that area. So even then, I really, really ask that you take what I say um, with a pinch of salt. And I will continue to say that moving forward. What I'm going to have are links to charities and organisations that are there for mental health areas for young people. So if you really feel like you need that kind of support, then please go over and check some of those organizations out because they are much better suited and equipped to talk to you and facilitate that sort of thing. Um, otherwise, otherwise, here are some of the other ideas that have been shared. So yes, mental health, talking about that. Then, of course, staying entertained, uh, staying positive. There's things such as quizzes. I can run quizzes, right? That'll be fun. Um, then, this got really specific, right? We got really into the nitty gritty. Puzzle feeders. If you have a pet, right, I got into this thing where my cat's just, you'll get to meet my cat. Just a little bit on the fluffy side, just a little bit plump, I had one too many snacks between meals. And so I decided to make puzzle feeders my own um, instead of ordering them. And they seem to have worked out pretty well. Uh, so of course we'll have a video talking about puzzle feeders. Then uh, there's gaming videos. Now I honestly have done YouTube and I'll say this once and once only and you'll see them connected to my channel. I did three years of YouTube gaming videos, right? If you want to see me doing gaming videos, I'm a slightly different person back then, um, but you can head over and I'm not joking, there are thousands of videos that you can watch of me doing gaming videos. So I'm not going to do them here um, because uh, that's, that's already been done. And it's not that I don't want to do it, it's just that it's been done and there's a whole backlog of videos you can watch of me playing videos. Beauty tutorials. I don't know how much I want my partner to be on this, nor do I know how much she wants to be part of this, but if, if we find time and you want beauty tutorials, then, you know, sure. I'll, I'll, we'll have my partner do, do makeup on me, that's fine. Uh, cooking videos. Now that's actually going to be very interesting because we're all in a place where actually we need to be resourceful with what we have. And so I would love to do some videos of the kind of cooking I do, which is definitely bulk, but at the same time doesn't use a massive amount of food um, where you can still get your nutrition. And actually, I'd, I'm not vegetarian by choice, but I've just found that I just consume meat too much. So I cut back and actually my partner's vegetarian, so I don't eat a lot of meat at all. So actually, I still have a diet that gives me all the nutrition and stuff that I need. And if you guys have any advice out there, then, you know, you definitely pass it on. Um, fashion. Now, again, I was like, I, might, I didn't realize I was fashionable. Didn't realize, you know, if I, if I, I the, the trousers I'm wearing right now, like, what? Huh? Huh? This is fashion? I don't know. I don't know. But, you know, um, these are... You guys want to see me talk about fashion, um, but I think that's because the learners that I've worked with have seen the kind of clothes that I do wear and they've kind of been like, how do you do that? And, you know, other than you put one arm here and one arm there and then you head up here. and So, yeah. And then this one, this one I cracked up while writing on the board. I just and maybe maybe this is just an example of where we could go with this. <laughs> one learner actually asked me, right? How do you spark one spark bear man in a pub? How do you do that? <laughs> I'm looking forward to answering that one. Um, not that I've ever done it. I, I've never one sparked anyone in my life. And you can probably tell by the way that I talk and the way that I am. I'm not a one sparker. That's not, 
that's not something that sits in here for me to do any sort of sparking. So, <laughs> so, so I could certainly try to do a video about that. But by all means, send questions in. Um, and obviously we'll, we'll go through those, but it can be a variety of different things, right? This will be that kind of the Dan's Den, um, what can we say? Oh, actually, there's something for you. Name this playlist. Dan's Den what? What is this space? The recreational, Dan's Den recreational playlist, where we just chill, we know, we just do random stuff and see what happens. But those are the sorts of things that happen here. So if any questions you have, any suggestions you have, put them in the comments below and we'll, we'll, uh, we'll get it done. We'll have a good time. <laughs> oh, I've never sparked. Uh, was it what? I don't know. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Um, but I'm really looking forward to it. And looking forward to you guys enjoying this space.